Machine learning is the most popular technology nowadays. It is now used in practically every sector imaginable which has increased its importance exponentially. But what about individuals who are unfamiliar with machine learning? That's where AutoML or Automated Machine Learning comes in. Automated Machine Learning provides methods and processes to make machine learning available for non-machine learning experts so that the efficiency of machine learning gets improved and the field research gets hastened as well. That being said, I welcome all of you guys to this session where we will understand the notion of AutoML, what it is and why it's a big deal in the coming future. But before we do that, I would like to request all of you guys to enable that subscribe button and bell icon so that you never miss any update from IntelliPath YouTube channel. First of all, we shall look into the agenda for this session. We'll begin this session on a very friendly note by talking about what is AutoML. Then we'll talk about the problems in AutoML along with processes involved in AutoML. Then finally, we'll talk about benefits and applications of AutoML. I hope I have made myself clear with the agenda. So without wasting any time, let's get started with the first topic on our list. What is AutoML? The digital transformation is driven primarily by the data. As a result, various companies are looking for opportunities to gain maximum value from their data. And that is why data science is gaining more ground across all the sectors. The skill of machine learning, which is a crucial field of data science, also has grown in popularity. ML algorithms are trained using statistical methods to imitate the way humans learn and make a decision. Machine learning is becoming increasingly useful in businesses of all the sizes. The most popular examples include fraud detection, marketing agencies automatically targeting consumer groups, customer care chatbots at banks, store customization and suggestions for e-commerce items and so forth. Machine learning has achieved considerable success in recent years and an ever-growing number of disciplines rely on it. However, this success crucially relies on human machine learning experts to perform the task such as pre-processing and cleaning the data, then selecting and constructing appropriate features for model training. Next thing is selecting the type of model that will work best for given data set. Once the model is picked up, the optimization of model hyperparameters will be achieved. If the deep learning model is being used for training, then the machine learning expert will also have to look into the design of neural network topology. After doing modeling, the post-processing of the machine learning model will begin. And finally, the expert will critically analyze the obtained result. As the complexity of these tasks is often beyond non-ML experts, the rapid growth of machine learning applications has created a demand for off-the-shelf machine learning methods that can be used easily and without expert knowledge. We call this resulting research area that target progressive automation of machine learning as the AutoML. I hope that the generalization of the term AutoML is clear to all of you guys out there. Next, we'll talk about the problems in AutoML. AutoML has had a lot of success in applying AI developments, however, there is still opportunity for improvement in the AutoML implementation processes. The problem arises when the interplay between data, models and humans comes into that. For starters, AutoML developers find it difficult to interpret unstructured and semi-structured data. Yet another issue to emphasize is that the contemporary AutoML framework optimization goals keep on changing constantly. Besides that, there is no way to make an informed decision until the final results are disclosed. Furthermore, it's difficult to implement automated machine learning and obtain trusted outcome as the conditions are changing at high speed. The AutoML applications that are currently offered by the market can only run on ML model program, for example, PyTorch. Another challenge that is worth mentioning is that making a model explainable is difficult with AutoML. Partly, it's even question of personal judgment. The solution found may not meet the final user's expectations. Organizations have to work on developing the standard related to understandable consistent ML. 
that is why these problems are significant when it comes to auto ml now moving forward we'll talk about auto ml processes model selection automation of training process hyperparameter optimization tuning are auto ml's most valuable features this requires the use of various techniques the first one is deep learning and neural networks this type of ml is based on the idea that human neurons have the ability to respond to triggers and interact with other neurons by sending them signals this entity of millions of nodes is called as neural network nodes can deal with complex problems by splitting them into smaller tasks that's the notion behind neural networking for example the neural network that is in charge of recognizing dogs might have a layer of nodes determining whether the object is furry another layer may look for tails or legs or color pattern this complicated system develops automatically through constant training with thousands of examples neural networks are good in environments that are highly complex and constantly changing machine learning is a fundamental change in computing we have passed the times when the enormous amount of data collected from different sources could be processed manually now it seems almost impossible and fully ineffective unlike traditional software programs neural networks are scalable new layers are added without increasing any sort of complexity and the basis of auto ml is neural architectural search or nas algorithms the effort of automatically selecting one or more designs for a neural network that would generate models with low losses for a given dataset is known as neural architectural search searching for a neural architecture can be costly and time consuming you can judge this yourself i mean think how much time it takes to tune in the model being machine learning expert doesn't it take hours it takes right similarly gpu days often thousands of gpu days are widely utilized as a search and training time metric hence it is quite self evident that neural architecture search must be improved the bulk of neural network model breakthroughs such as image classification and language translation have required substantial hand tuning of the neural network design which is time consuming and error prone even when compared to the cost of high end gpus on public clouds data scientists still remain more costly than the auto ml solutions hence more efforts are being put into the tuning of auto ml softwares the another type of technique that auto ml deals with is meta learning meta learning or the so called learning to learn is the ability of various ml approaches to work on different types of data sets it results in learning from the outputs being more effective and conducting new task much faster moving forward we'll talk about benefits of auto ml the first benefit we have is that auto ml saves time data scientists are not born with the ability to predict the best alternative and hyperparameters for solving a problem they manually test models tune hyperparameters and evaluate models to arrive at the best model for a particular problem with auto ml the process can be done automatically in less time by transferring the data into the training algorithm to automatically search for the best suitable neural network architecture or nas for any concerned problem this can save us lot of time another future we have on our list is auto ml fills the skill gap today every business is very aware of the latest ai and digital trends to compete on a large scale but companies usually struggle to find the right talent there is an increasing demand for ml engineers or data scientists that businesses are unable to find in that case auto ml can work to bridge the shortest of skill people in an organization the third benefit we have is increase in productivity it is clear by now that automated machine learning can simplify the processes by applying ml to real world problems it focuses on running all the steps to solve any particular business problem while reducing the complexity of testing developing and deploying machine learning frameworks this results in increased productivity at a instance then finally we have enhanced scalability certain ml models can mimic a few human learning processes and auto ml helps to apply this at a larger scale auto ml also reduces errors in application of ml algorithms 
as any business starts growing the amount of data also expands auto ml eliminates the possibility of inaccuracies in the algorithm due to human neglect or error as a result a business can introduce new innovation generate new business benefits and gain higher roi on ml projects with accurate algorithms and processes now let me show you guys where this auto ml is applied the first application of auto ml i have on my list is time series forecasting data scientists and machine learning engineers use time series forecasting to predict the events happening in the future this is done by analyzing the data and a series of values observed through the time but time series forecasting is a complicated and time consuming process auto ml automates the entire process including hyperparameter tuning feature engineering for discovering predictive signals model selection and many more then we have classification problem a classification problem is a type of learning in which a data is assigned to a label or class handwriting recognition item detection and fraud detection are all instances of categorization or classification problem auto ml can assist in automatically deploying an advanced classification machine learning model to generate insights in no time then we have feature selection predictors also known as features are critical components of an ml model predictors frequently rely on machine learning algorithm selection which if not done correctly can affect model development time and scoring by applying an automated evaluation procedure to get the mix of stable and strong features auto ml simplifies the feature selection process then at number 4 we have algorithm selection the most daunting task in machine learning is finding an optimal algorithm however data scientist can infer the right algorithm by referring to a data set auto ml uses an automation process to identify the most suitable models and algorithms for a problem then finally we have model evaluation it is a technique used to validate an ml model's performance in simple words model evaluation is the process of determining whether the model is overfitting or underfitting auto ml automatically evaluates an ml model's efficiency among the given set of evaluation metrics i hope all of these applications are clear to all of you guys out there that's all we have for this session today if you have any queries please feel free to drop them in the comment box below and make sure you hit that thumbs up button as well until next time thank you also don't forget to stay tuned with intellipath youtube channel for more technical updates if you want to make a career in data science then intellipath has iit madras advanced data science and ai certification program this course is of very high quality and cost effective as it is taught by iit professors and industry experts